Hi and welcome along to the Bias Premier League show. Uh, we've got a special for you today because obviously there's been no games, mm. well, no Premier League games mm. over the weekend to talk about and uh, of course we always talk about the Premier League mm. games. So what we thought we'd do today is do a show where we're going to talk about who we think so far this season have been the best signings mm. the worst. and the worst signings. And the worst signing is going to get hammer on. He's going to get hammer on. You know how we do. And so we do. Back again. Just before we get into that, mm. though, there's a small matter of a big game coming up this weekend, right? When Arsenal are going to be taking on Tottenham. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, we all know last week we got beaten by Man City. This is a big game. Just before we get into these signings and out, I just wanted to, you know, it's a week's gone now. You've had time to calm down. Yeah. Um, from your city, <laughs> the city <laughs> one where you were losing it. Yeah, man. Um, feeling a lot more optimistic with the uh, Tottenham game coming up? Not really optimistic, but it's North London derby, so I'm up for it, innit? you understand? I just hope the players are up for it, like me, fam. Like, we all know that like, family members, uncles, whatnot, Tottenham, mm. you get me? So like, my family what? are Tottenham, so I have no choice but to win this game, blood. You understand? <laughs> Do you know what? I often wonder to myself, right? Do the Arsenal players know what it means? Really know North what London the derby. North London derby means? Because it is literally, for me as well. I mean, I have to turn my phone off for the week if yeah, we lost. Yeah, or more. Yeah, because because I would get just like yeah. I would just get totally destroyed mm-hmm. by Tottenham fans. Um, and you know, I remember speaking to Paul Merson, mm. and Paul Merson said to me, "He goes, you know what? He goes, Robbie, I don't know if these players nowadays understand." how much the North London derby means. He goes, when I was playing, he goes, I'd be on holiday in the summer. And he goes, when the fixture list came out, I'd ring my dad up, he said. And he goes, Dad, when's the Tottenham game? He goes, that's the first thing he'd ask about. Do these guys... I mean, Jack Wilshere gets it. Jack knows. I think... uh, Anyone else? I think Awobi knows. Awobi will get it. I think Bellerin gets it. Bellerin will get it. He tried one like a little bad boy. So you better know the little rod. You better know the (laughs) rod. You understand? I think uh, Bellerin I think, for that game shaves off all his hair comes in with a skinhead yeah <laughs> Theo knows Theo knows Theo normally does well against mm. them lot as well but I think they, Czech knows even though he's not British I think the amount of time he's been here the games he's played for Chelsea as well you understand Chelsea's got the same hate for Tottenham as us so I think he knows what he means playing a derby so I, think players, I think even players like Alexis will know because he's from you understand he's been in Real Madrid Barcelona mm. I, I think he's more interested in the Manchester. Yeah, I think I, I think he's more interested in uh, Man Man City Liverpool. <laughs> no, Man, Man, yeah, Man, Man, City, United, Man United Liverpool. Man United Liverpool. Man, Man City Man United. Man City Man United or <laughs> Man City Everton like the, the the North Blue. You get me like you little shit. I like his. All right, all right. I'm yeah. good. I don't want to set you off again. Yeah. But um, but you think think we got a chance to to win now? I mean, they're on fire. Out of yeah, but North London derby, there's always a chance in it. You understand? Form goes out the window. We know this. When a derby, form goes out the window. Blood, you get me. And I think they've only lost one game away. Yeah, and that was against Man United. You just, you just, you just. No, I'm just saying, man. You're giving you me no to... hope, blood. I should have no, come no, on. No, no, no. I should have done this week with tie blood. It brings an optimism, fam. You get me? I swear to hell, blood. I should have no, been tired. Well, we've got to be real, though. Nah, it's true, though. We have to be real. We've got to be real. You know what? I remember doing an interview the other day, and yeah. um, he's, he's one of the fans that I was interviewing was saying, he's going, boy, he goes, I'm worried. Mm-hmm. And he goes, when? He goes, I can never remember being worried about that. Was me. That was me, bro. Was it you? That was me, bro. <laughs> That was me. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you know you lost it. I see. You didn't even know you're talking to me. You understand? Like you know you're. Mm, I was in. A, I was, mm, I was in a daze. You understand? Yo, go on, go on, bed. <laughs> <laughs> now that was me. I've never been scared going into a North London derby, especially at home, because normally especially at home. we don't lose them at home. Really, exactly. The last time we lost was when Kabul. Yeah, oh, got that God. goal. Fabric guys gave away the penalty. The fucking yeah, I idiot. Remember, I remember that. I remember Hamble, that. Stupid idiot. You understand? Two 0 up. Bottled it. Do you remember when they equalised that? Four, was it four four game? Oh fucking hell, Lennon. Oh my. Yeah, the worst God. thing is, yeah. Do you know that fucking little idiot that jumped on the pitch after the four four equaliser? Mm. He was the one that threw the beer at West Ham with the thing in the cup. You see, was that? it? Yep, it was him. Yeah, yeah, it was him. Uh, Dickhead. And he was let back in. They let him back in. FA, he sort his life out, bro. Seriously. I, well, I he's, he's going to get sorted out now. He better, he? I think Tottenham you know I mean? banned him for life. Yeah, good. Yeah. 
Anyway, that's the North London Derby coming up at the weekend. We're going to be doing more shows on that, right? So look out. Me and Trips will be doing a preview on it. Mm. There's lots of stuff building up to that game, so that's going to be happening at the weekend. What's your favourite North London Derby moment before we move on? Favourite North London Dar- Just Derby quickly. moment is when we went to Tottenham and we won, won the league. league. Um, you will never beat that. It's classic. Uh, even though we didn't win the game, it really disappointed me that we didn't win the game mm. in the end because Lehman gave away a stupid penalty right. at the he end. Licked down Robbie Keane, like. <laughs> yeah. you know Lehman was a gunman. Yeah, he was. Uh, he was bad. Stepping in six sharp bad. box. Move. Uh, and I've got a really funny story about that game because a mate of mine was mm. at the game, yeah, and um, we were all struggling to get tickets, and he was in the Tottenham end, right? Right, and he sat in the Tottenham end. And <laughs> I don't know how he managed to do it. Right, and he was having to keep really quiet. But where he was sat in the Tottenham end was like, I think he's like a lot of season ticket holders, isn't okay. it? So like, um, he was sat there. A lot of them were like, who the fuck are you? You know. It's so he one. goes, there was a guy sat next to me. The guy was all pretty friendly. Mm. He was chatting to him. So he said, he goes, oh, he goes, Robbie, he goes, when we scored, man, and he goes, oh, when we're looking like we're going to win it, he goes, I really want to celebrate, but obviously I got to hold it down, mm. right? And he goes, they're way at, at, at the end now. When they got that equaliser, they all jumped up and they all like. You know, and he's the guy, he goes, the like, guy next to him's hungry. Yeah, 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 yeah. We beat the scum and all that. And he's going, yeah, yeah. yeah and right, right. and he's right. like, champion! And then, <laughs> but this is, this is the funniest part, right? He goes to me that at the end of the game, now, yeah. the guy goes, mate, I'll tell you what, yeah. You know, I, I know you don't, obviously, you don't get to come to many Tottenham games, but if you want to come to another game, give me a number. You know what I mean? I, I, I'm friendly with a load of the lads around here. So, you know, when some of them can't get to come, they pass the season ticket over and sort you out, right? So he's like, I better play along with it. Yeah, you better play mean? along, bro. He goes, because, like. you know, obviously <laughs> the game's finished. We won the title. We, I mean, we're running around. Yeah. All our fans are going mad. So he's going, yeah, yeah. He goes, oh, no, that'd be great. He goes, that'd be great for me to do, right? So he goes, he takes out his phone to take the guy's number, presses the button on his phone. He's got Arsenal screen safer on his phone. <laughs> He was a good as well at the time. So the guy looks on his phone. Right? He's so the guy, he goes, the guy clocks it. So he's thinking, shit. So the guy clocks it and goes, oh. Right, so he goes to him, he goes, he said to him, he said to me, he goes, Robbie, I have to think fast. So he goes, bloody hell, my son, messing around with my phone again. He goes, yeah, you know what it's like, man. He goes, I've been trying to persuade my son for ages to be an arm, to be a Tottenham fan. But well, you know what he's Arsenal. like, bloody glory on yeah, that. He's gone with right. Arsenal. He's got, yeah. he's bloody changed, <laughs> he bloody changed the, the, the screen <laughs> on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> and the guy goes to him, yeah, you know what I mean, mate. He goes, my son's like that, but I'll kick him out of the house if he can like that. He goes, but anyway, I'll take your number. And he goes, that's how he got out of it. He goes, boy. And he goes, he goes so he the guy goes, where would you drink, man? He goes, no, nah, I'm going to stick around here for a bit, mate. You know what I mean? I'm just going to stick around I haven't been here for such a while <laughs> I want to sort of take and he goes when the guy went now he's just watching all the Arsenal fans yeah, celebrating yeah. and all he, <laughs> like, that is like one of the, the funniest That's stories funny I've ever story. I mean he was moments away from getting his head kicked Blood, he would have got through off the stand <laughs> through off the pitch cards you understand anyway let's get into what we come here to do right which mm. is we want to get into the best signings mm. and the worst signings so far in the Premier League now I've got some candidates here that mm. I'm going to run through um Best signings. Mm. Lukaku, Man United, 70 on million. Mm. He's been scoring scored, goals. Yeah, he's scored, he's been, been he a bit quiet his, recently. He scored in his last six, but he has been a yeah, decent signing. He's would you agree with that? He's been one of the. Yeah, he's been one of the best signings out there. I don't have to put him in one of the best categories still. Um, Matic, Chelsea. Yeah, Matic, definitely Matic. I think he's added what United needed to them. I said Chelsea, United. Yeah, United he was so much yeah. a part of Chelsea. Went from Chelsea to United. Mm. Um, Mourinho, Mourinho said that he was shocked when uh, Matic's agent called him and said, do you want your manner? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. There's a lot of people are like, well, what were Chelsea thinking of? Yeah, because he, yeah, him and Carney was like, just yeah. perfect. It's, just, it's worked in tandem. Right, but, but now, yeah, um, Morata, Chelsea, come in, big price tag. I think he's, he's done, done all right, man. He's, he's been done all right. That, that goal he that scored. Goal, yes, that goal, uh, that that goal, goal last scored week, the other day. Jesus Christ. Yeah. That was a banger. And he, he scored goals, hasn't he? Yeah, he's, 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 got been, a lot, yeah, he's done well. I think... Yeah, I'd put him on the best still. Yeah, he's, 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 he's got, got big, big shoes big, to yeah, fill. Yeah, exactly. He just hit yeah. the guys up my mouth. Big shoes of uh, Costa and him. Yeah. So, yeah, I'd put him on the best still. Um, Kalasinac, awesome. Yeah, 100%, blood. This is the common fam, you understand? He's like Ronsal, blood. Mm. It does what it says on the tin. Mm. You understand? You ain't coming down here like go back Bellerin or something. It's not your typical Arsenal player because he's a big exactly. guy. He's he reminds strong, me a lot he's of tough, he's rough. He reminds me a lot of Ivanovic when he first mm. went to Chelsea. That powerful, yeah, uh, right back or left back. Powerful that can runs get you a goal. Goals. Scores goals. Can get you a goal. Can, he's good got a defender. Great, yeah, it's great. Uh, great ball. Yep. 
end product free and a free an Arsenal Wenger yeah. classic uh, you know free not, costs man. nothing if he, well if he cost money <laughs> from Schalke if he cost money we wouldn't have got him anyway <laughs> Alexander Lacazette like a blood clot Zet. good signing yeah six goals in 12 games very happy with mm. that I'm very happy with that fam doesn't especially play, when you consider he hardly plays doesn't, doesn't start every game <coughs> doesn't finish every game and the man's got well then you can say didn't start against um, Liverpool Liverpool didn't uh, start against City. City which was both of those mm-hmm. ridiculous uh, Stoke yep they start against Stoke and then they no no, no 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 didn't he, he start? He didn't I thought he started against. Start. Start. No, that's when they brought him on against. Stoke, Remember, no, he, he sc- didn't. He start and he scored. A, he scored didn't they bring him on? He did scored he the goal and it was disallowed. Yeah, I, f- I thought they brought him on and he scored. And then he I sh- think he started. Did he start against Stoke? I'm, I'm sure he started. I'm not like, you can get you know. You don't, don't know. You have to Google it. You have to Google it. Did he? I did not see it. Um. But he's been a great signing. Yeah, fantastic. Right, he's been a great signing. He's hit the ground running. Exactly what we needed. Salah. Yeah, Liverpool, yeah, yo, yo, Mohamed yo, Salah. Yo, they call him King Salah. You understand? He's he's on bits, bro. Banging. Like, do you know who he reminds me of? He reminds me of Alexis the first season we got him, where he's just on that left hand side and he's just causing every team. He's so him, quick. Bro. He's so quick. He's, he scores goals. Yeah. He's like he's he's. He even know, tracks back, bro. He's a he's hard a, worker. He's an excellent player, and there was a Egyptian lot of people. I, I, I knew. I thought he'd do well, right? I was because, a bit because, because do you know what? I saw he'd been doing in Roma. But and he the, was brilliant at Roma. It's the Italian league, and then when he was a bit, yeah. You know, but sad. listen, he was doing bits over there, right? And then like I saw that he was coming back, right? Mm. And I was like, you know what? Everybody's thinking just the Chelsea times, mm-hmm. right? But this guy's actually been playing really well. Yeah, from Basel over days. there in Italy. Yeah, from Basel yeah. days as well. And um, he has been a revelation mm. because he, revelation. He's uh, he's highly thought of in Egypt. Before uh, him, their main guy was like Hadji, no, not Hadji Mido, sorry. Mm. And they had another guy. Um, the one that was at El Wigan. Mini? No, the one, that, <laughs> nah, the one that was at Wigan. Uh, Zaki. Oh, yeah, yeah, Amir yeah. Zaki, blood, you understand? And another brother called Zidane, who was at uh, Muchen Gabla. Yeah. Quality midfielder, blood. But I think uh, Salah's taken the mantelpiece. Salah is the role like, he's, he's a king of yeah, Egypt, man. man. Um, Richarlison. Yeah, the Watford. little... Yeah, man, the little diving, little Ross boy. <laughs> but he got a wicked goal last week, I guess. I love the way he went around Pickford. He's only young, isn't he? Yeah, he's young, blood. Brazilian, I think mm. Chelsea... I'm gonna look he's at him. finishing, though. Like I remember in that Chelsea game. It was poor. His finishing was poor. If he can get that on yeah. point, but for he's still new, young though. For a new signing, for a new signing, he's, Premier he's, League, he's, he's been doing well. Yeah, for us, but uh, um, Pickford, Everton, he's had a lot to do. <laughs> you see, this is the thing with me now with Pickford. Yeah, I think that he's, I think he's a top signing, blood. I think he's a top goalkeeper. I think he's a hot prospect. I just think that obviously when you got hand rolls like Lescott and fucking not Lescott, sorry, fucking uh, Williams and fucking Jagiel, because you're centre-back's blood. It's, 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 there's no hope, fam. You get you might as well have there. You know, his so kicking could be better. He's, yeah, his kicking Pickford. is terrible. I think I thought Chet's kicking was terrible. Blood. Nah, fucking Pickford, hell, man. And you know what? I remember. I realized that five two blood. Ever, yeah, oh yeah. Jesus Christ! Do you know? What? And I remember him when he played for Sunderland. Yeah, we made a four one and, and, and thing. His keeping was good, and I remember yeah, thinking, "Boy, his yeah. kicking's terrible." Yeah, it's terrible. So he's got to work on that, but. But he's, he's one of the top he's signings. A, he's a keeper. Because he's gonna that be... used to be an area of weakness for Everton. Now he's coming mm. now. I think and for England as well. There was a period yeah. where we had a lot of shit keepers, Paul Robinson yeah. and then Talking about, you know, you know, yeah, yeah. So Now we've got uh, Pickford. Yeah. You hear me? So, yeah. Right. Worst signings. Mm-hmm. Now you're talking on the goalkeeper um, thing. Mm-hmm. Joe Hart. Yeah. Not really. He's, don't ask me how he's England's number one. Maybe he has nudes of Southgate. <laughs> <laughs> because they're not them they're blood clot team I ain't got a clue blood I swear to god fam Butland should be starting yeah Butland or, or even pick, give Pickford yeah, a run Pickford. Uh, you got uh, Forster's not really on form at the mm. moment you got Ben Foster there's a lot of man that's yeah. above him fam you understand but the Joe Hart signing at West Ham hasn't worked has it nah not at all blood like, he's, he's uh, the way the the mighty have fallen blood from Premier League winner to some any team in Italy and now you're in uh, the London Stadium it's, mm. the, it's just a sad fan Lindelof Man United like, after, yeah. ain't had much of a chance yeah but, but when he had that chance against Huddersfield <laughs> Lord have mercy Donny man was watching it like boing. like he fully watched it like, like what, what? I mean he come highly rated from Benfica and he, listen but he, even that league is remember another... we're saying so far right we don't mm. know this guy yeah. could turn out he to could be... turn out to be like a Bailey yeah a quality defender but at the moment oh. from what just a little at bit the moment, he's looking like, at the moment he's looking like Mertz like oh. <laughs> nah, you look at that Squalachi. Remember that man there? <laughs> Stefanov. Stefanov. That man, Stefanov, 6 1 in them team. Lord have mercy. Man look like that man there. Man like Oleg Luzhny in them man there, you know. You understand? I take it, man. There's something better them, than you know. them for Man United. Jesus sake. Christ, you know. Uh, drink water. Danny drink water. Yeah, blood, Left from Leicester, went to Chelsea. To drink water. 
Because he ain't playing. <laughs> so what's he doing? Man's got Chelsea to drink water, blood. What? Something wrong with the Leicester water. Come to get that London clear boo. It's a weird one, isn't it? It's a weird he, one, isn't he, it? He's starting... Starting line up week in, week out. One of the main players of the team. A, a fan favourite. And now you're just drinking water. Played last week against uh, United. Yeah, but he um, came on but, as a sub, didn't yeah. he? Yeah, uh, he... he, he it's a weird it's one. A weird Even one. when Kante was out, he still wasn't. He still weren't in the thing. Like it shows you, like Kante, Kante didn't want him. Basically, Kante didn't want him. He's just there to add numbers to the squad. But and you can see he was starting every week. He's in the England team. Yeah, but it's not really difficult to get in that England team, is it? Yeah, but he's just killed his chances now. Hasn't yeah, he? definitely, fam. It's definitely it's dead. You, it's, it's his World Cup dream has gone. I got one for you, Oxlade Chamberlain. I don't. I don't know if he should be in the worst signings. I think because he had a bad over the past couple yeah. of weeks. He's been all right. He scored in his last. Um, I think his last two Liverpool games. He scored. He definitely scored in the last one, didn't he? He's he's, he he's scored away starting at Mar- to. Yeah, he scored away at Marrow. Got off to a bad start, but yeah, he's starting he's to finding his feet. Yeah, you've been hating on him a lot. You've been throwing hand rolls at him left, right, and centre. Yeah, but no, I don't think he should be in the worst signing category. Ox, not in the best signing. I think for the fee, but not in the worst signing. I think the fee puts him in there. Forty million. That's what you're doing. You got to be one of the worst. I know you put Wick. <laughs> What? Arsene Wenger yeah Wenger New Deal in the worst that's the fun jeez <laughs> I'm talking about players yeah, that's, the, that, that's, 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 that's the worst one blood. that's the worst one they, they, let's they, keep this with players yeah? they're not topping that you know I trust you to slip that in we're they're not topping that blood trust me we're keeping it as players right you're lucky Wenger um, the hammer is oh, coming I've got one for you Adrian Silva Who's Les- the brother that the, the guy who signed for Leicester as a replacement for drink water but it but he missed the deadline by 14 seconds yeah. so we ain't even seen so him. he's gone again Leicester just I think Leicester just get the ham rolls blood <laughs> that's what I know he might just fucking about blood that's just that's just that's 14 mad. So seconds he, he's, yeah, so didn't he's not, we no, but when we got asked him in that season uh, we, we missed it was the that, deadline we even Welbeck that. it was about it, it went for a half one in the morning I think they've tightened it up now though have they and if you miss it and they miss it by 14 seconds because I even heard that Putin had to okay the Arshavin door to go yeah. through he plays or else. Yeah. <laughs> um, Could Putin do that again to Wenger? <laughs> Leave or else. <laughs> um, Sigurdsson. Yeah, he fucking oh. Do you remember when Sigurdsson was good? That's the line that everyone uses when he moves <laughs> club. When he was at um, Tottenham. When he was no, when, yeah. When he left Swansea to go Tottenham. Do you remember when he was good? When he left uh, Tottenham to go back to Swansea. Oh, do you remember when he was good? Now he's gone to Everton. Oh, do you remember when he was good? You're just shit, blood. He's like he's Icelandic, isn't he? Do you, you know the? Do you know what? He's technically very gifted. He's a brilliant. He's player. very. He's got a lovely technical happening. ability. But I, I just think don't though, think I just... think though, it's got a lot to do with Everton how they're playing him. Yeah, they're not playing to his. He's strengths. a number ten. That's where he played at. And they're playing as a striker. And they got this guy when they play right, against, the when they play against us. He's playing on the left wing. On the left, he hasn't got the pace. He's got no pace, blood. Yeah, so he has to be one of the talking ones. of Swansea. Wilfred Boney, he's gone back. Has he he's been played? a disaster. Has he even played? Been injured. Has Tammy's he's not in looked there, in it? shape. Yeah, because he just looks like he's not interested. Renato Sanchez as well. Uh, I mean, at the time, everyone was like, everyone was like oh, "What? What's he doing? Going from yeah. Bayern Munich to Swansea on loan?" Yeah. And what, how's Clements it? using up his Angelotti links, Bayern yeah. Munich links, but then it's but just gone. Again, yeah. he's he not looked fit. He's he's had injuries. He's he's been poor, and he has a lot. He's of not. Uh, and you'd have thought. You know, when we remember watching him in the Euros, man, mm-hmm. he was fantastic. Mm-hmm. But he's got a lot of uh, attitude problems. He's another one of them. Probably y- you can imagine, animal. right? You can imagine the guys that buy him. Swansea's a good night out as well. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably raving every weekend. But I'll take that for free, fam. It goes down in the valley. But what I'm saying <laughs> is, right? He's at Bayern, and yeah. he's like at, amongst all the yeah, best players in the world, and that. That's yeah, Alaba. Yeah, man, you're Neuer, and now you're chilling with. Uh, Fabianski. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> you remember that fucking... What's his name? Uh, that, that Cork brother. Jack Cork. Yeah, Jack Cork. <laughs> you understand? The fuck is this shit, blood? Man's like, what was it? I used to call with Jabby Alonso. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? <laughs> that? You understand? When I go on international duty, I'm with Ronaldo. Now I'm with Boney. You understand? Like, some Boney the pony. Like, love it, blood. I've got one more for you. And now to Rich at oh, West Ham. Blood. Left no, from Stoke. Yeah. Just, just give it, just give it to another. This is a bit of a. I, I found that was a, a, a bit of a strange signing. Mm. They paid a lot of money for him. He has about thirty million, and he's gone million. there, and he's been a dis- No, I think he's a bit less than that. Wasn't it twenty five? Twenty five. But he's gone there. He's been a. Dis- he's on massive he's wages. Sent off in his first game. Sent off in, in his first or second game. He's been terrible. He's. 
I mean, and he was a man that you thought that he'd go there and he'd, he'd, he might be the pirate. You understand? He no, might be yeah. the one to they like. He ain't and, no uh, pirate, man. I no, but I'm that. saying, no, but I'm saying, like you know, like you know, West Ham they when they certain time they always have a flair player, and then that flair player will be like kind of the leader of that team. I thought that mm. like, he was gonna maybe him, him and Lanzini would yeah. link up together and maybe push on. But yeah, ain't my yet. man's just gone there to get his money, fam. Yeah. You get me? He's chilling in. He's probably in a bar. You know, Stratford, it's a nice area. You get me? A couple of wine bars out there. You know what I mean? Probably go to Levi Rules, get some little jerk chicken. You, know, you get me? Little shopping in Westfield. You know, he's thought this is bare sheep, blood. Bare fields, fam. They ain't fuck all up there, blood. He's thinking, whoa, what's this? I used to live in a, I used to live in a farm. Like, I, I had to walk 10 miles to get my fucking milk, blood. Now I've got to come into my yard, cuz. You understand? It's like, it's, it's, it's like Lion King, blood. It's, you know, it's like Aladdin, blood. It's a whole new world, fam. You, you won't be going back to Stoke anytime soon. Nah, Ty can't go to Stoke. <laughs> I can go to Stoke. I don't know, I don't think you. After what you just said about Stoke being a farm, you know what I mean? Nah, come on. I don't know if you'd be going back to Stoke re- the arms. Um, yeah, they'll probably leave me in a farm. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to run down. And then, so I want you to choose your best sign in. Yeah. And then we're going to choose your worst signs. So let me just oh. remind you of the best signings yeah. again, right? The, um, the nominations mm. for the best signings so far. Lukaku, Man United. Matic, Man United. Um, Morata, Chelsea. Kalasinac, Arsenal. Um, Lacazette, Arsenal. Mo Salah, Liverpool. Richarlison, Watford. And Pickford of Everton. Who are you picking? It's got to be Salah, man. Salah? It's got to be Salah. Okay, so Mo Salah. Salah. Of Liverpool, best signing yeah. so far. So far. So far. Remember, this is so yeah, far. at the moment. But so far, he's, doing um, best. he's been the best, yeah. right? Now we're in a worse signing. Mm. You want to get your hand roll? Get your hand roll up. Wait Wait up. not included. <laughs> we're doing managers <laughs> run on another video, yeah? You're obsessed with a guy, ain't you? Blood. You're obsessed with hating on Wenger, I've man. I've for 21 years. I'm bored, fam. <laughs> right, listen. The guy come when I was a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? <laughs> And he's gonna probably leave when you need Viagra. He's gonna come when I need Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, blood. He's right. seen the whole cycle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Right. The worst signings, we're gonna run through those. Lindelof of yeah. Manchester United. Danny Drinkwater of Chelsea. I think he's at Chelsea. Yeah. All right. Apparently. I'll take your ox out of it. Ox not in there. Yeah, well, right. we'll take our ox. Um, Adrian Silva. Mm. Of Leicester, who can't even play till January, mm. so we haven't seen none of him. Sigurdsson, Everton, Wilfred Boney, Swansea, Renata Sanchez, Swansea, or Anatovic of West Ham. It's got to be Anatovic. You going Anatovic? Yeah, man, it's got to be Anatovic, blood. The way he's carried himself at that club, like, it's just disgusting, fam. I feel sorry for the Hammers, blood, you understand? I feel sorry for the people that actually put his name in the back of their shirt. You are the ham roll as well, blood. <laughs> <laughs> you might have share it with an out of it. <laughs> you get me? I swear to arm blood. It's so peak, fam. I'm oh, so gosh. So, so that's, there you have it. Winner, Mo Salah, best um, signing, worst signing goes to uh, Mark Anatovic of West Ham. Let's go straight to the London Stadium. Straight to the London Stadium. Might do a little detour by Levi. Levi can have Put some a jerk, jerk, jerk on it. You get me? It. <laughs> a little cheese. <laughs> Thanks for watching the Bias Premier League show today. Um, we're going to be back next week. Of course, it will be after all of the games at the weekend. And hopefully, we'll, we uh, hopefully I'm Christ. just hope. It, you, know, you know what? If we if we if we beat Tottenham, man, let's have a little drink and yeah, that going on there, man. Let's yeah. celebrate, yeah. Champagne on you. Yeah, yeah. we're doing that, right? Yeah, so up. let's see what happens. <laughs> all right, so we'll be back next week. But um, thanks for watching the Bias Premier League show. <laughs>